Coming Out of Hibernation, written by Sophie Bunston, pictures by Kathy Wickman. It is getting cold outside. There's something in the air. It seems like danger's coming, with animals scurrying everywhere. Some are collecting leaves for homes. Some are collecting food. The biggest thing that I have noticed is everyone's changing mood. Come here, my darling little one. It's time to go inside. There's lots of things we can do in here, like play and run and hide. What about Pygmy Possum? Can I go and play with him? Not right now, said my mum. Everyone's staying in. Everything we do now has to be inside. No more playing with my friends. In here we have to hide. The world is still so good and my friends are inside too. But we have to wait in here until the sickness passes through. We're doing things at home now that we've never done before. Painting rainbows, making cakes, all while staying safe indoors. School is in my house now. I'm learning in different ways. Mum says this could last weeks or months. I thought it would just be days. I miss my friends. I miss my school. I even miss my teacher. But most of all, I miss the way the world was before the fever. Mum says it's important to stay at home and not to go outside. It's warm and cosy, safe in here, a perfect place to hide. I'm used to all the changes now, and things don't feel so new. Homeschooling is getting easier. Things to me don't seem so blue. I think I like being home now. I love being with my mum. Spending whole days in my PJs with her, lots of things are fun. Hibernation isn't bad. Staying inside feels so safe. Who knew that when this started I would learn to love this space? It's nearly time, said mum, for us to go back into the world. I like this space, I think to myself. In here I feel so held. What if the world looks different now? What if things aren't quite the same? What if my friends don't play with me? What if it all has changed? Do things look like they were before? Is everything still there? I do not want to leave my home. It's outside now, I fear. You said it wasn't safe before. How is it now you know? Are you sure hibernation's over? I'm not sure I want to go. Come here, my dear, said my mum, in her loving, gentle way. I wouldn't send you anywhere, not knowing you'll be okay. Some things have changed, some things have not, but soon you'll truly see. The things that are most important are still there for you and me. The sun still shines, the wind still blows, there's birds up in the air. Schools will open, friends will greet you. Teachers waiting for you there. You'll still play games and fill your tummy with lots of yummy food. Soon you will see the world outside is safe, in a better mood. Some things will be different. You will notice all the changes too, with your temperature checked to see if you're well and extra things to do. You'll still keep your distance in certain ways, of that I'm sure you can like waving instead of hugging and continuing to wash your hands. But don't you worry about all the things you can and cannot do. Grown-ups are all around you to help guide and see you through. Hibernation is almost over and soon, my love, you'll see. The important things have stayed the same. That's the way it will always be. The End